Welcome to First Man Satellite World. This is Master Original S100 HD Plus. Master Original S100 HD Plus. You see, this decoder is hanging. It cannot boot computer. It will remain like this, on, like this. And you can see it, the logo will only display on the screen, like this, Master. It, it, it cannot open computer for you to uh, work on it. How to solve this problem using a PC or a laptop? How to use, uh, how to solve this problem using a PC or a laptop uh, successfully? You will need like this. Uh, you will need a hardware tools, and the hardware tools you will need are a serial cable. As you can, this cable, as you can see, you see, uh, the uh, these are serial cable. So you need this serial cable like this. You can see one end is a USB port, and the other end is like this. This this end this usb port will go into the into your computer your computer or your laptop and this part will go into your decoder so uh, you can see this junction to this uh, this is a serial uh, cable uh, everybody knows that so like this you insert this uh, usb port into your laptop if i using a laptop uh, or if i using a computer uh, you insert this part into your uh, usb port uh, USB uh, side of the serial cable into your USB port of the computer like this as you uh, have done and and the other uh, end of the cable as you can see yes like this you insert it in the decoder as you can see I have opened the decoder you see I have opened it uh, let me put the decoder off yes I, I put it off I put it off I put it off uh, you can you see i can see a port inside look at it this is an empty port if you open any master original original decoder not fake decoder genuine master original decoder you see this uh, port with these three pins this is called a serial port this is called a serial port rs232 port rs232 port this is a serial port it is with only three pins okay uh, these three pins uh, one is JND, one is RX, and one is called uh, one is called TX. Yo, so you insert this part. I cannot explain all. It will make my video very long. So you insert this other uh, part into that port like this, as you can see. You see this port. You insert the other part here like this, like this. Yes. You 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 fix it. Yes, inside like this good so you can see yes I, I i put the other end in the decoder like this so like this uh, the uh, 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 another hardware tool you will need is a usb flash drive it must be empty usb flash drive and must be virus free you will uh, put the decoder software that's master original s100 hd plus you will look for a software and put it on this empty usb uh fra flash drive and you rename it flash.bin you rename the software decoder software flash.bin so please rename it don't delete the file extension renaming it don't delete the file extension you have to only write flash and leave the dot bin so you add your flash the dot bin to be flash.bin that's it so after renaming it uh, uh, the soft renaming the software uh, on the uh, USB flash drive. You insert, you can insert it in any of the decoders USB port. You can see one is in front here, and one is at the, at the back, like this. Uh, you can you can insert it at any of the port. So uh, I prefer to uh, insert it. I prefer to insert it at the back of the decoder, like this, like this. Yes, I, I I prefer good. I prefer to insert it like this. You see, my software is already renamed uh, on my USB flash drive. So like this, uh, what is left is a PC software tool for this program. So uh, I go to my laptop and look for a PC software tool for this program. So if if you look. On my laptop uh, down here, 
you can see first man loader here 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 first man loader yes so i open this i pick a load a folder like this and this is what uh, is displaying as you can see yes first man loader so uh like this i open my application you see yes here first man downloader boot yeah this application i open it like this and you can see uh, the uh, application is open and the chip type you can see you have to set it to order chip type order and the boot file you see master original uh, the chipset is jx6605x it's jx6605x all master original decoder chipset are jx 605 s so it's a jx 605 s generic generic board the board the board in the master original decoder like this this board this board is a jx box a jx board uh, so it is jx 605x generic uh, board so you choose this jx 605 s generic s flash uh, boot like this okay then serial port you choose the port uh, of your computer or your laptop you see my uh, my port my serial port is com3 now yours can change to be com4 uh, com5 com6 yeah depending on your computer or your laptop so mine is com3 and here is serial down you change it because i'm you i'm I, i'm flashing it with usb you change it to usb down here this one you choose this one as you can see you see usb down yes we select it like this usb down then this pass section is all yes don't make any changes to uh, uh don't make any change uh, any change here don't make any change here so uh here you come you can see file file you can see this place is empty so in this place you rush you write uh flash you write flash dot bin the one uh, you, uh, how you rename the software on your USB flash drive, you write the same thing uh, uh, at this fireplace that flash dot bin flash. The first letter must be uppercase, which is flash flash dot bin flash 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 dot bin dot bin dot bin dot bin flash dot bin dot bin like this as you can see yes you write it like this so like this you are done with your computer uh, software uh, tool settings so you after this you only click start if you look down here you, can... you see now you press start if your settings like this you can see yes flash dot bin no, now you press you click on start and then you turn the decoder on you turn the decoder on you see i'm turning my decoder on you turn the decoder on like this after you have click on uh, start now you can see it will start reading like this this is how to solve a booting problem of master original s100 hd master original s100 hd this is how to solve the problem